Welcome back to another prediction video. Uh, this video was hard uh, hard to make for me because uh, Bashik Shahir lost to Copenhagen uh, 3-0 today. An absolute score uh, that wrecks uh, the heart of a lot of Turkish uh, football fans, um, which means it'll be nearly, um, it'll be really hard for us to go in directly into the Champions League uh, now. The first place will have to play a um, play playoff to get into the Champions League in 2021-2022. It's absolutely a huge blow to Turkish football and the club federation level. Um, so I still have that sadness over that 3-0 loss to Copenhagen today. But, um, you know, give me your condolences. It's gonna, it's gonna be better. It's gonna be better one day. Okay, let's hop right into this Champions League prediction video. Um, we have some of the legs finished. This is the round of 16. I actually tried making this yesterday, but somehow it just black screened, so it wasn't working. So I'm doing it, doing it again today with a little bit less mood, but it's okay. All right, let's hop into the games. First, we had Real Madrid lose to Man City. Um, I think they were up 1-0. Yeah, up 1-0, lost 2-1. Next game, we had Lyon versus Juventus. Um, Lyon actually secured a W over Juventus. Uh, we saw Bayern absolutely destroying Chelsea. Obviously, Chelsea fans were disgusted. They said this was this is rubbish. They said this is not acceptable. I think the same way. Most of the fans said so. Napoli and Barcelona tied in an absolutely empty stadium. Uh, the game in Chelsea was with fans, I remember. Atlanta went through. Into the quarterfinals. What's up, Atlanta? Oh, I remember those days um, when I was 8-9. Galatasaray used to be in the quarterfinals uh, against Real Madrid. I think it was the 2013. It was the 2012-13 edition. Road to Wembley. We remember Wesley Snyder, DDR Drogba. It was an insane, insane, insane experience. Take this from a Galatasaray fan. Relish those moments. They don't come in easily. Quarterfinals in Champions League is a big thing. Don't even if you go down against PSG, it doesn't matter. This is huge for your team, Atlanta. We saw Leipzig go through against Tottenham, which was absolutely insane in my opinion. Um, and then we had um, what else did we have? We had Atletico defeat Liverpool, and then we had. Paris defeat Dortmund. Um, it was absolutely insane. Uh, let's start off from here. Yeah. So, yeah, Leipzig won 3 0 the second game. Um, let's see. The first game in, who do you think is going to go through? Real Madrid or Man City? I'm saying the Mans themselves. Kareem Benzema, Rodrigo. I'm saying Real Madrid. I'm saying Real Madrid. These guys have been dominating this competition for decades. I haven't seen them go through in the round of 16, maybe last year, but I think they went down in the qu quarters against Ajax last year. Uh, next, we have Juventus versus Leon. I mean, I don't want to talk much about this. Relish the moments, Leon fans, okay? Round of 16 is great accomplishment, but I think Ronaldo is an absolute beast. Um, he knows what he's doing, so I'm going to give this to Juventus. Next up, we have Barcelona versus Napoli. This is a little more... You know, this, the last two are a little more conservative views. This one's going to be absolutely insane. I'm saying Napoli goes through into the quarterfinals. I know they didn't have a great Italian, you know, league season. But I think Barcelona is absolutely devastated by getting second place, I think, in the La Liga. Absolutely devastating to, you know, be up, you know, up front, be the favorites, and lose it to Real Madrid. Absolutely insane. So I think... Napoli will go through with Mertens. Last but not least, we have Bayer München. Bayern München. Oh, what a team, what a team versus Chelsea. You guys remember this from 2012. Champions League final, Chelsea won. I think they played twice. This was an insane saga, insane series. Um, Chelsea could come back, but I think the rubbish 3-0 will be the end of their campaign this season. I'm sorry, Chelsea. You guys are out this season. Done. Bitti. 
in Turkish. I'm going to give it to Bayern München. Um, we're going to be out here uh, in the quarterfinal, not draw. The draw has been made. The quarterfinal predictions, I'll be out here. Hopefully, I'll be in a better mood. Maybe. Maybe Galatasaray will get a couple signings. <laughs> I don't know. It's not the best day for Turkish football today, Başakşehir. But I just want to say thank you, Başakşehir, to getting into the round of 16 of the Europa League. Even that's good. You know, I'll take that. Even if we got eliminated, I'll take that. Stay with soccer. I'll stay with football, not soccer. Stay with football. 